This though is something else. Wow. So welcome to the islands. I think I'm going to do a little house tour for you guys because we just checked in. It was about a five minute drive from the airport and we had two stops on our way. So we left Montreal this morning at 8.50 and now it's about 1.30, two o'clock I think in the afternoon. Um, but there's an, a one hour time difference as well. So we just got to our super cute little house. I'm gonna show you guys around now. We have our little kitchen and dining room area here with a humongous window with views of the ocean in the back. Another window with some great views. We have our living room here with another crazy view. Like, look at this. Can't get much better than that. And upstairs, here's, always afraid to bang my head on the ceiling though. We have two beds here in this room. We have a double bed in this room and another double bed over here. So you can comfortably be six people in this little house. I think it goes for about 300 a night in the summer. Um, off season like we are now in like late October. I think it's like 150, 200 bucks a night. Super affordable. So yeah, we're gonna go and explore the, the island a little bit today. Show you guys some cool photo spots while we're here and what you guys can do when you're here off season because that's the whole point of this trip. So without further ado, yes, is doing her little Instagram tour. Let's go. So this is our view for the next five days. Can't complain. We're going to Le Petit Capitaine. October 29th, we are eating outside. Crazy, huh? What the heck? It's last, amazing. Last terrace of the year, maybe. Maybe not. All right, we're gonna enjoy this and then we're gonna go hunt some, some views for the sunset. So we made it just in time for the sunset. We got so lucky with this first day. It's been beautiful so far. The color of the rocks, I think, is what impresses me the most. Reminds me of PI where we were in like July. This is one of the most popular spots for sunset on the island. So tonight, I think we're about six people here, which is like the main advantage of coming during shoulder season. Um, it's a bit chilly. It's like six, seven degrees, but honestly, with a little coat, we really can't complain. So we're gonna pack it up, take a few last photos, and we'll see you tomorrow for sunrise. still pitch black outside. So we're gonna go shoot the sunrise this morning. We're only headed about five minutes out from the house, which is great. So we're just gonna hop in the car and head down. We're gonna go climb a little hill this morning, which is called La Butte Ronde, which means round hill. Anyways, it's a really popular picture spot here on the island. So it gives you a nice view of all the houses below, which are super picturesque and is one of the most popular viewpoints here. So we definitely want to check it out. And this might be our only sunrise because it, they're announcing clouds for the rest of our state. So we want to absolutely get up. I don't see a cloud in the sky. I'm looking through the window now. I think we're going to be okay. 
So it should be really nice. Just waiting for Yas to get ready. Got the Keurig coffee all set up and we'll be out. Trusty Chevrolet tracks ready for action. That's what we're gonna go climb, or I'm gonna go try to climb, so you can get pictures of the houses down there. So I gotta make it up to the cross. Oh, I don't think I climbed the right side, because the path was really steep. I'm trying to find the way up. Look at that. Holy shit. What? This is the view I wanted to take a picture of. But pretty much it gives you 360 degrees. Because on the other side, you have the village down there. You have the lighthouse over here. So, all in all, really great if you can find the right path to come up. So basically it's right in front of the parking and it doesn't look like much, but you just kinda gotta keep going and it takes about 10 minutes to get up. Um, so now it's sunrise. I'm gonna take some pictures of these houses and of the view, I'm gonna head back down. Wow, that view though. Um, got some pictures of the houses of the sunrise. Gonna head back down now, take a few photos with the ass, cause she wasn't able to come up. Her ankle still hurts cause she sprained it like two weeks ago. And it's pretty steep to get up here. So, gonna go down, catch some sunrise with her as well. And then try to find some breakfast. This though, is something else. Wow colors. Where's he going? Come on, buddy. You got it. You got it. That's it. I had like a 100 to 400 too. Success! There he is. He got his weight.